everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I am working on some iron on on some performance shirts today for my sister-in-law. And I am using a new iron on. It is a sports flex iron on from 143 vinyl. So I'll give you my thoughts on that uh, sports flex HT knee. And I give you some tips on weeding the vinyl or the HT knee off of your mats. And also tips on layering um, iron on onto the shirt. So come along with me. Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Sandy if you're new. And today I am making some shirts. I am making, these are for my sister-in-law, Oldham County. And this one I did blue background with white trim. So I have about four more shirts to make. So that's what I'm into today. This is the project that I'm making. I am taking these initials OC for Oldham County and printing them out on iron on and putting them on the shirts. So I'm actually using a sports flex iron on that I got from 143 and I really like how it's very smooth. Um, it's not like sublimation, but it's still, it's a really good option. Because you can't do white sublimation, um, a white color. So I couldn't quite figure out a way to do this with sublimation. But I really like how this sports flex is turning out. And I got that 143 vinyl. The reason I wanted the sports plaques was because these are uh, polyester, um, if not 100%, nearly 100% polyester. And so sublimation would have been the best option, but um, that wasn't going to work in this particular design. A couple of tips when you're weeding. Um, when you have multiple files, I went ahead and cut each one so I'll be able to weed each one separately, so that'll be easier to control all the scraps. And then I weed on the mat because it kind of gives you an extra hand um, to hold the whole thing steady as you're pulling up the scraps. Another tip when you're layering iron on, you do the first layer, and even though it called for 25 seconds, I only did it for about five to 10 seconds. And then I um, layered on the white iron on on top of that and then heated it up for the remaining 15 seconds. And then you flip it over and heat on the back for about 15 seconds. So just remember when layering iron on, you don't go the full length of time on the first layer. So what'd you think of those shirts? I think they turned out really nice. My sister-in-law loved them as well. I will definitely be using that Sports Flex HTV again um, on polyester and performance type shirts. I really like um, the smooth smoothness of it and it's really light to the touch. It's not really thick at all and it stretches well. Um, so thank you all so much for watching and I hope you like the tips that I gave you today. Please check out all my other Cricut videos and I will see you all on the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.